bună dimineața, good morning, băgăm un horror. Another horror game. Ce faci, tată? Start the game. Bă, trebuie să dau conspiratorul. Păi dai conspiratorul, că e mizerie. Oh, skip to end. Much easier. Ok, a bit lighter. Don't play alone. Play alone. Play with your friends? No. Collect tables. Oh, okay. Okay. Collect tables. Oh, something is missing here. Okay. Bonus features, the anthology. Okay. I played Man of Madden. I played Little Hope, House of Ashes, and I don't have this one, the devil in me. VR. One game is missing from the collection. Ok, let's check the settings. Display, HDR on, ok. Audio and language. Subtitles minimal, all minimal. Headphones, thank you. Yes, save. Play alone. New story. Oh, your skills will be tested. Survival is expected. Forgiving. Let's go. Challenging. For they have sown the wind and they shall reap the whirlwind. Every choice has a consequence. Some decisions save lives. Others lead to death. Oh my god, that's spooky already. Choose wisely. That's uh, this is that kind of game. You have to play it more and choose different. 
options there. My voice is still broken because of the flu, so... will pay the debt our king demands. Your sacrifice will lift his curse from our land. General Bellato, forgive me, my lord. The king demands your urgent presence. Where are the subtitles? For now. Take this one back to the cell. I'll deal with him later. You're in luck, Gutian. Luck? No. No luck for these dogs. General, we should leave this place. The king, his madness threatens to swallow us all. This temple is cursed. I'd rather die in this cursed house than perish to the plague and famine out there. We have our orders, Captain. sent you to destroy my kingdom. I know it, girl. I see everything. Look around you. Is this hall not famous enough for my mistakes? Do the gods not bask in its glory? The Gutians are coming, General. The moon god sends an army to destroy us. I shall muster our forces immediately. Good. And what news from below? There are hundreds of prisoners, my king. Their sacrifice will take time. Time is no longer in our hands. No matter. The blood of this army will nourish the sands. The sacrifice will be fulfilled. Starting with this one. <laughs> Tell me, General. Does she remind you of anyone? My king? Do you not see a hint of your own daughter in her? What age would she have been now? Eighteen. Eighteen? Hmm. What a tragedy this plague has been. Kill her. Uh, let's choose now. Say nothing. Complain. By your command. Oh! Oh my god. I didn't have the time there. I forgot that if you press right or left, you already choose the option. Okay. It's okay. Ah! <laughs> 
Give me strength. the temple at Nippur. He builds this temple to call for forgiveness. But the gods don't listen. And now he too is silent. My king? Free of his madness now. Okay. Balatu and Kurum. Balatu was shocked at the death of the king. Current objective, work together to escape. We don't have pictures, secrets. Bearings, okay. Are we Die. This is your temple. What can we do?
There is a way out through the catacombs. You think I should trust you? You have no choice. I've got you. Help me with this. Follow me. There is a way out through this tomb. Tomb? Yes. For the builders when they're done. Come. Just a rat. How many men died for our king? Their sacrifice bought him nothing. Okay. But why we don't have subtitles? now Anything hidden? We are cursed by our own actions. Why did your king grade the temple? Same story that history has taught us. For gold, for glory, for greed. Premonition. Okay.
Here. Help me with this. You first. We're safe down here. You first. What is this that adorns you? Nothing to concern an Akkadian. How do we get out of here alive? The enemy of my enemy is a friend. We help each other. There is always hope. What was that? How many ways into this tomb? We're not alone down here. Over here. No escape. Our only hope is to stand together. No! If we both run, then we both die. Ready your sword! was the last to die in the temple catacombs. I missed the circle, but I think they had to die anyway. Won't you spare me over till another year? 
No song. I can't skip this. Definitely the copyright music. And I'm going to put this on YouTube. Where are the subtitles? I don't understand. All. Oh, I didn't. Okay, all. On the choices you make, they will be as a compass guiding you through the unknown. Will you find the path to salvation? or be lost in the darkness. Let me speak plainly. You're about to make some difficult decisions. Decisions that will affect the lives of others. How those decisions play out will become clear over time. It's good to see you again. You're probably keen to get started. Let us not dally. Gata. As you are aware, welcome I back. Great, the custodian of tales. My purpose is to keep a record of everything you do, every decision or mistake you make. This is my repository. Stories, stories about friends and enemies. Loyalty and betrayal, life and death. Understand that I am not here to help you. Although I have been known to bend the rules from time to time. To descend into the unknown alone is extremely brave. Or extremely foolish. Perhaps there is more to you than meets the eye. Let me give you a few words of advice. Throughout the story, you will encounter certain pictures. Pictures which allude to possible outcomes. I suggest you pay attention to their meaning. It could foreshadow... No, my attitude is singular. <laughs> but alas, sands of time have run out of us. We meet again bine. soon to see how you what is this?
Jason Kolkak. Colonel, good trip. Harry King. Not particularly. Welcome to Camp Slayer. You're early. Uh, impatient, apologetic. Uh, no, impatient. Is my briefing room prepped? Eric did not properly introduce himself to Jason. Oh. Techs are ready for your presentation. As soon as we get word from the CEO, we're good to go. You should read this. The new year? There's a new king in the castle. Looks that way. You are? This is my assistant, Clarice Stokes. Dr. Clarice Stokes. Gold check. First lieutenant, gold check. Well, the briefing room? I made a bad choice there, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, hello. What's up, Marine? Can't you keep up? Rachel King, CIA. And Nikkei. This could be our last time together, Rachel. After what happened at the checkpoint, uh, I thought I was done. These last few weeks, you've, you've lifted me up. I don't know where I'd be without you. Rachel King? Colonel King has arrived on base, ma'am. He's en route to the briefing room. I'll be there in five. Fuck, it's him. He's early. Your husband, you mean? Don't you think it's about time you came clean? Put your clothes back on. Straighten up. Hey, Rachel. Are you gonna tell him about us or what? You and Eric have been apart for a year. Whatever you had, it, it's gotta be over. Come on. Maybe I just don't think this is the right time. Okay, let's, let's be good. Let's try to be good. That's bullshit. There's just... It's on. Soon, Nick. I promise. Soon. I'll see you at the briefing. Shit. have to excuse the noise and disorder. We're just getting the base set up. Hmm. Blows my mind. Only a few weeks ago, Saddam was living it up in here. <laughs> Chowing down in candy bars while some poor bastard clipped his toenails. Nice image. Uh, if only you could see the state of this place now. Makes me smile. <laughs> we got the CIA. We got the Army, the Marines, DIA, the Air Force. Hey, everyone's invited. Everyone wants a piece of history. God bless America. See you, old man. Keep busting out those reps. Hey, you come join me. Maybe I'll teach you a thing or two. Later. We have company. Yeah. Well, you miss here would let you watch me get my sweat on. Huh? You wanna spot me, little lady? I can see you just fine from here, thanks. Ignore Corporal Merwin. He likes social skills. Uh, I guess every unit has its resident jackass. So 
Sergeant Kay. This is Lieutenant Colonel Kane. Just taking him down to the briefing room. Yeah, gotta go get prepped. I'll see you in there, Marine. So, what's his malfunction? Nick ain't been himself lately. We got caught up in a shooting a few weeks back. Civilian ate a bullet. Nick took it hard. Is he combat ready? He's a big boy, sir. He's ready. He's ready for your wife, too. Damn, Joey, they got you sitting behind a desk? You want me to make a call? Nah, I'm all good. People who sit behind desks don't tend to catch so many bullets, you know? So this must be uh, the one and only satellite guy. <laughs> satellite guy. I'm Eric King. Lieutenant Colonel Eric King. Give the colonel full sight access. Sir. I'm telling you, when the queen bitch finds out about this, she's gonna flip her shit. Uh... That's my wife you're talking about. Okay, we have two downs. I had no idea, I'm sorry. Nice work, hot shot. Oops, we are not friends. <clears throat> but your wife, she has something to tell you. Sir, I'm so sorry. Rachel never said she was married. We've been working apart this last year. So, she's the queen bitch now. She's gone up in the world. If it helps, we like to think of it as a term of endearment. Brett, let's get you shut up. I hope the bandwidth can cope with the data. I'll leave the techie stuff to you. And I'll leave the heavy lifting to you. We got a deal, lady. What is this place, anyway? Looks like an old ballroom. Uh, that's exactly what it is. I guess you're damn Survey right group objectives. To Directorate of Central Intelligence. Directorate of Central Intelligence. The objectives of the survey group are as stated. Organize and direct intelligence capabilities across coalition government agencies and armed forces. Okay. We didn't have the time to read because the game is moving on by itself. <coughs> Colonel King. Mrs. King. Eric, this is my team. And if you want to brief them, you clear it with me first. I should have warned you. Briefing forward. That's on me. But... Related, I had to move fast. I have a duty to my team to stay ahead of the curve. I understand, Rachel, but CENTCOM has given their orders. Orders? I'm now commanding officer. I didn't mean for you to find out like this. Truly. I'm sorry, Rach. Somehow I doubt that very much. This is from Sox Central. It confirms that Lieutenant Colonel King has assumed control of this operation. I'm gonna need access to your network. I'll patch you through. Name? Dr. Stokes. You can call me Clarice. Dr. Stokes, please prepare the presentation. You found something?
fuck is that? Modern art or something. This is footage from the highly classified Kalis program. That's supposed to mean something to me. It's a thermal satellite system that I personally pioneered. Oh, well, I'm impressed. Please, pioneer away. You behave like this in all your briefings, Corporal? Boys are just eager to catch a break, sir. No harm meant. Very well. Satellite sweeps of the war zone have uncovered what appears to be an underground storage facility. This will, of course, require further investigation, but I strongly suspect it's where Saddam's chemical weapons are hidden. We got you, you son of a bitch. CENTCOM has given the green light to raid the facility and seize any weapons on site. Hostilities may be over, but there are holdout groups of Republican Guard all over the country. They could deploy those weapons at any time, so we need to move fast. The Army is giving us a ride out there on their helos. On arrival, Lieutenant Kolchak will lead the raid on the facility. Once it's secured, we'll carry out a full weapons inspection. Now listen up. There's been a change of leadership, but Rachel's operational expertise and local knowledge is just as valuable as ever. She'll be flying with us, and I want you all to show her the same respect. Any questions? What the fuck are we waiting for? I'm ready. That's tribal territory out there, Colonel. Make no mistake, those people are feral. I take it we're getting their support? Nah. And I think that there is the temple fast in, fast out. from long time ago. What your mama said to me. Hey, careful, boy. Well, I didn't pull out so fast. Could have been your papi. <laughs> All right, that's enough, Merwin. Sir, what's your goal? Let's go. Confident. We keep this thing small. If it goes south, I'll pull the plug and we can bug out. With all due respect. I don't know when that appear the ch the chosen thing appears on the screen it's on the white it's white and the background it's again white I didn't saw that That's the wrong call with all due respect Lieutenant Kolchak it's not your decision to make Air support Eric refused to bring close air support on the mission It's so Merwin has a point. If we spin up too many helos, we'll increase our chance of being spotted. Any concerns, see me after the briefing. We go dark until weapons are secured. If we don't break radio sounds within 24 hours, CENTCOM will mount a rescue operation. A lot of shit can go down in 24 hours. I'll quit being a bitch. I'm just saying, that's all. This is why we went to war. This is what gets us out of bed every morning. Make no mistake, ladies and gentlemen, this is how we stop Saddam from using these weapons. Be ready in one hour. Dismissed. Larisse, help me stop the equipment. I'm on it. I don't know, man. This don't feel right. I'm getting this tingle down the back of my neck. Oh, sweetie, look. Good rub down, we'll sort that right out, huh? I'm serious. I got a real bad feeling about this. That's what you get from spending too much time with Eric. Is there anything you can do? I'm gonna download the latest satellite data. You can have some alone time with him. Thank you, Clarice. Eric. We need to talk. There's something I have to tell you. You should know. It wasn't my decision to take over your operation. It's been a long time since we last saw each other. Eric. Please, let me finish. Not a day went by when you weren't on my mind, when I didn't want you by my side. I've missed you so much, Rach. This isn't about us, Eric. I just want things to go back to the way they were. How we left it, 
things weren't so great between us. We've been through worse. A lot worse. <sighs> Nothing has changed, Eric. You know that. You and I, there is no you and I. It's over. Please, Rach, don't say that. Rachel told Eric that their marriage was over. Okay. You're not wearing your wedding ring. Hey, be careful with that. Oh, shit, sorry. What you got in that box of tricks anyway? What the fuck is that? Ultraviolet light. We use it to sweep for explosives. Let me have a go. No. How much longer for that download, Clarice? I need it ASAP. It's five minutes ASAP enough for you? Downloading data now. Good. I'll check the satellite maps. Not the greatest bandwidth. We work with what we have. Can you sign this 1348? Huh? Equipment release form. Can you? Oh, sure. Check all equipment, then check it again. Yeah, I hear you. Okay, wait for the download. <coughs> I'm not going to read because my voice is so broken. Stay focused. What I think it is. WP, sir. White phosphorus? It's just for popping smoke. That's all. These are only for cover. Understood? Understood. After all, Saddam is the one who's breaking weapons conventions, not us. Secret. This file reports that aid workers have gone missing near the Iranian border. Okay. Oh, this was the first page. crap for we need to be mobile we need to be prepared the facility is underground possibly under construction it's safer this way you want me to feel safe you give me some more shooters relaxed so you're my technician i've heard about you I should fucking hope so. I'm here to keep our gear in check. And if any Iraqis pop their heads up, I'll take them clean fucking off. 
You seem pretty confident, Corporal. If you need any assistance with the climbing gear, I'm here to help. Sure, I'll manage, Colonel. Climbing gear. Fucking pencil pusher. Yeah. You think we'll bag Chemical Ali at this facility? If he's in the vicinity, we'll get him. <laughs> that almost makes it worth the risk. Almost. Well, you know, I'd still rather be sitting behind a desk. Sir, I've heard some fucked up stories about the border. You sure you don't want air support? There's a chance we'll need him. We have the element of surprise. I will not allow anything to jeopardize that. Please, Colonel. Can we take a step back and think about this for a minute? I've made my decision. You feeling lucky, Lance Corporal? Well, my parents owned a horse named Lucky. He ran away. Bet the farm on this. I have a good feeling we're gonna clear up. I wish I shared your optimism, Colonel. Okay. Anything else we didn't check? I think I checked this one. Downloads complete. Let's get to the Let's helos. go. Let's go. Let the horror start it. What? What? You want to ask me something? I can tell by that look on your face. What do you think of him? I take it you're talking about the skipper? He's a nice guy. Around here, nice don't cut it. What do you think of him? Like he's got something else on his mind? <clears throat> what? Courageous and stubborn. Zane, and a gate. Zane. Happy birthday. Go ahead, Zoe. Hope that we don't find him dead. Okay, let's take the first door. And this is the bathroom.
sehen. Sehen, Tani. Ja, Bell. Hallo. Hallo, äh, Anna Salim. Salim. Salim Garkun. Abu Zain. Abraham. Ich werde es. Ich werde es. Zain mit. mit. Ich werde es. Ich werde es. ايوه طارق هم مع بعض راحوا ياخذوا الاتوبيس بقى لهم ساعه كله بخير؟ لا لا كله تمام اصل كان عيد ميلاده وانا جبت له هديه هي كويسه اه لما يرجع ابعتهولي حالا ما اقدرش اقول امتى هيجوا انت عارف الولاد اي وقت ابعتهولي لو سمحت There was something else on the oh. table there. Captain Basri, Ahlan. I'm going to go to the house. 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 I'm going to يلا شوف جايين علينا بقول لك احنا محتاجين كل راجل في مكانه لاحسن طايرتهم توصل عندنا تمام يا فندم 